So thank you, Leif, for being here at the Bavarian booth with us today. Could you please just introduce yourself briefly and give us an overview of the SEMI organization? Absolutely. So thank you for the invitation. Great pleasure to be here. Uh, so I am Leif Artemimi, president of SEMI Europe. Uh, SEMI is a global industry association that connects manufacturing, design, uh, and all the way up to the ecosystem, up to the system level integrators. We have over 2,800 members globally, and the, the key differentiated value of SEMI is its global footprints. We exist in seven regions, uh, the US and Europe, Japan, China, Southeast Asia, Korea. Uh, so we really co cover the whole ecosystem of the, of the global semiconductor industry. How are you? Great. Yeah, I think that's exactly why you know Bavaria had interest of being a part of this and be represented here in San Francisco. Sure. So Semi Europe will be taking place in Munich next year. Could you tell us a little bit about why the Bavarian capital is a good location for a meetup of the semiconductor industry? Absolutely. So we this is now our sixth year uh, having Semicon Europa, which is our flagship. So we have a flagship in every region, like here Semicon West. So our flagship is Semicon Europa. And we moved it to Munich to collaborate with our business partners from Messe Munich because they hold the Pro Electronica, Electronica. So this it creates A, the largest electronics platform in Europe, and it connects the semiconductor industry with the end applications, which is what our industry is now. And also Bavaria is, is a strategic hub, a strategic European hub. You know, you land in there and you have the Infineon, there's a lot of ecosystem and already exists in terms of automotive, in terms of other, uh, you know, uh, semiconductor, Infineon and other key players, including international, you know, uh, uh, existence in, in Bavaria. So Munich itself is seen as a European central hub, which is proved to be a strategic move for us and our partnership that we continue to grow year on year. And that really truly represents the European ecosystem in, in the best possible way. Yes, thank you so much for sharing that. And I think on behalf of Munich, the region is very excited for yes. the event to be taking place there. And you've gathered over 30 years of experience in this industry, and you've already touched on some of these points. Why would you say Bavaria, Munich, Germany as a whole is a good location for yes. the semiconductor industry and its companies? Right. And I think, so uh, Germany, uh, we have, let's say, three, but Germany, France, Italy, they're the sort of the key players in the semiconductor industry. Belgium with IMEC right. and uh, Netherlands with ASML. Germany is, is very well positioned for manufacturing, as you know. And you know, you have Dresden, which has become really continues to grow as a strategic hub, but Bavaria is, has the key players. You know, Infineon is world number one in power electronics. So Germany has, um, has the ecosystem, a very well established ecosystem that makes it easier to attract, you know, A, to grow our, our local competences like the Infineon, Bosch, um, NXP, ST, XFAB. But also what we have seen in most recent announcements, there's great inward investments, you know, with WolfSpeed, with Intel, um, and that continues to really strengthen Germany as a, a, a key strategic ecosystem in the global semiconductor value chain. And Bavaria is known for industries and R&D, notably like mobility and aerospace, quantum computing, yes. life sciences, and industry 4.0. Yes. How do you think these industries relate to and benefit from the semiconductor industry and vice versa? Right. What kind of synergies do you see there? So uh, they're absolutely the mega trends. Uh, so currently the, semi the global semiconductor industry is around just short of, of uh, 0.6 trillion. And this has taken, you know, 50 years to get here. But there always has been one mega trend, you know, computing, mobile, a network. But now there are multiple mega trends, exactly the ones you mentioned. And these are the mega trends that are running in parallel, you know, driven by AI. Um, artificial intelligence, which is enabling every industry. And this is what is driving this exponential growth to the one trillion everybody's talking about by 2030. So it's great opportunity for Europe because it matches its core competences in the global value chain. Mm -hmm. So looking specifically at U.S. companies, you know, many of the major ones have operations, R&D facilities in Bavaria. From the perspective of the semiconductor industry, what are the key advantages they see in this region? How can they thrive there? And kind of where do you see this going in terms of U.S. companies and global companies coming to Bavaria to do business there? Yes, absolutely. So I think there is already a clear, uh, you know, investments in Bavaria, uh, which, all, which is always very helpful in order to attract and to build upon rather than you starting from, from nothing. 
so there's great, um, so Bavaria is very well, like it's also a beautiful place, this is a key. It has the ecosystem, it has the convenience, and it's also very well connected to all the strategic hubs in Europe. Uh, so it's a one-stop shop, you land there and then you can go anywhere. Uh, so this is, it's well established and you can only, you know, you, it makes it easier to attract for investment because they already have the feeling and the business uh, ecosystem that already exists in there. So it's a great opportunity to build on these core competencies, of course. These are the key where European, you mentioned Industry 4.0, you mentioned computing, uh, you mentioned automotive, as well as where Europe is a strategic place in terms of um, manufacturing, like as I said, the Infineon, the ST, the NXP, uh, the Bosch of this world, that are world leaders uh, in, in this area, which, which is great uh, to have. Yeah, thank you so much for, for summing it up like that. I think I can speak for all of us here at the Bering booth that that's exactly what we want to do in strengthening the transatlantic partnership, but also partnerships within Europe. Absolutely. Is utilizing this already existing ecosystem of Bavaria yes. to help companies thrive there. Absolutely. So, and I think, we are, we, you know, as I mentioned, we're a global uh, industry association that really the industry association in the semiconductor industry. And as this opportunity, we look forward to continue to collaborate with you to really enhance the visibility of Bavaria at, across all regions. Yes, we're very excited. And to just to wrap it up with Semicon Europe happening in Munich, what yes. are some other things on the horizon for you? What's next for Semi? So we have, um, from a Semi Europe, uh, we have an event, a technical conference in Grenoble. Uh, this is uh, on MEMS and imaging sensors. And then we have our annual uh, uh, Semicon Europa in, uh, in November. And this tends to be our last, you know, to end the year. And then we start the new year in 2024 with our industry strategy symposium. Uh, this we have in Vienna. Uh, around January, February time frame, and then of course the event calendar starts again 2024, right. which makes it very, very exciting. You know, you see it here and you see it the industry everywhere. There's a lot of energy, a lot of excitement, and the key message is, is really to connect and to collaborate. Uh, so I think this is a clear you know, area for us to really work together, to connect and to also promote the Bavaria region, to attract more investments in, in the region. Yeah, and I think on behalf of Bavaria and its companies, as well as Invest in Bavaria and our partnership at the booth, we are looking forward to this partnership to continue. So thank you so much for, Absolute for pleasure. stopping by here. Absolute pleasure. Thank you, Leif. Thank you.